And they're off in the men's 110 meter hurdles. Look out in lane number four, Josh Jenkins of Reading. And it's going to be in lane number five, Corey Noker of Pawama, Westphalia, crossing first. And we're off. Lane number one, Tom Mathis Bush, Corey Noker in lane two, Jahal Martin in lane number three. And right now in lane number two, it's a race between two and five. And at the. Oh, and at the flag, there is your winner. Uh, third best qualifying time, he's in lane three. Corey Noker of Pawama, Westphalia, is the defending champ in this event. He had a qualifying time of 38.60. Zach Ed, uh, Edgering of uh, Marcellus finished third in this event last year, a qualifying time of 39.90. Stephen Dean of Covert in lane six. Calvin Kyers of Lansing Christian in lane seven. Stephen Sykes of Litchfield in lane number eight as they make the turn. Corey Noker of Puama Westphalia has the lead in lane number four. Corey Noker. And Corey Noker has one more hurdle. And now the finish line. And they're off of the men's 200 meter dash. Lane one, Mark Cannons of Traverse City, St. Francis. Elliot Clark of lane two of Maple City, Glen Lake. Corey Noker of Paloma Westphalia in lane three. Ritten Bryant of Burton Etherton in lane four. Anthony Johnson in lane five of Sterling Heights Park. Whitmore Prescott and Cody Foreman in lane six. Clay Becker in lane seven of Gaylord St. Mary. And it'll be Elliot Clark. Or it'll be uh, Corey Noker of Paloma Westphalia coming across first in this race. Boy, we've heard Corey Noker's name before and he finishes first of the men's 200 meter dash.